Hello everyone, this is Warhawk Beyond 2040 and welcome to another edition of the Black Lightning Season 4 Review Series and today I am going to be talking about Episode 3, The Book of Reconstruction, Chapter 3, Despite All My Rage, which I have just finished watching and this was another great episode which picks up where we left off from the last one where we see now that Tobias is fully invulnerable to Black Lightning's powers and he knows his secret identity and all of his families we've seen Gamby now take up a different job offer and is working the R&D department to do the DEG weapons and we see that Chief Lopez is now hot on the trail to find out who is conducting all these mysterious attacks in Freeland and as we've seen Jennifer is now able to heal herself using the upper atmosphere so lots of great things going on and this episode saw a huge shocking moment which gave a whole new meaning to the term not sleeping with the enemy but eating with the enemy which I will get into in a moment but this was a great episode and as we've seen so far, we've seen Jefferson is still trying to deal with the death of his good friend Henderson, who was killed off at the end of season three, and he's still in mourning mode and in deep grievance for the loss of his friend, and he continues to not see eye to eye with Lynn and the rest of his family. So there was lots going on in this episode, and this was very very good and I really enjoyed this one a lot so with that all said let's not waste any more time let's get right into it let's talk about episode 3 the book of reconstruction chapter 3 despite all my rage so we start off with seeing Jefferson has a nightmare in which Tobias is in his house and has taken all of his family and despite all of his rage he attempts to fight him and Jefferson is not able to beat him he tells the therapist who tells him to stop deflecting, prompting him to finally admit that he doesn't know who he is without revealing his Black Lightning secret identity. We also see Lala and Devonte now have an underground fight club that is being operated and attended virtually. One of the fighters is the father of the child who was killed in the shootout in the last episode and who was a teacher at Jefferson's school. Jefferson follows him and confronts Lala and then ends up fighting himself, defeating the bigger, previously undefeated man. The media continues to stir anti-metahuman sentiments in Freeland, specifically using video footage of Jennifer as lightning due to the large amounts of property damage that she has caused in her recent attempts to save Freeland. Both Lynn and Anissa suggest Jen needs more training. At home, Lynn injects Jen's powers to test them on herself, specifically the healing abilities while in the bathroom, and Jefferson, just like the, the girls in the last episode, declares that she is not like them. She says she'll stop when he becomes Black Lightning again. And then in therapy, we see Lynn admits that she always feels like an outsider, in, even in her own family. It's a breakthrough, and the therapist tells her, just be yourself. Grace finally wakes up from her coma and we finally see Anissa and her get married in a hospital bed. Jen turns to TC to help her track down the person who gave the news footage of Lightning so she can release the unedited footage and help clear her name. She does, but the kid who is a fan says he'll help her clear her name by going viral. She has TC set up her social media, but she also starts having side effects for going up into the upper, upper atmosphere. Gamby gets his tour of Mona Vista and discovers that the next-gen weapons have a stun setting so they don't kill normal humans. Gamby smuggles one out of the gun so he and TC can learn more about how it works and it discovers that even the stun setting is fatal. We then see Tobias meets with the mayor who wants the city to take money away from Garfield High School to give to him so he can build a new fancy new hospital. The mayor refuses. He later sends flowers to Lynn as though from Jefferson but tricks her into having dinner with him. He wants all of her focus to be on the research for a cure for ALS in exchange for a decade's worth of funding for her institute and Jefferson ends up arriving at the restaurant and sees Tobias having dinner with his wife Lynn and he storms out not knowing that this is all part of Tobias's master plan to break him down and take everything away from him. And that pretty much wraps up the end of episode 3. Overall, excellent episode. Really enjoyed this one a lot. 
you can clearly see that Tobias is slowly starting to break the pieces from within and by having dinner with Lynn you know that's really going to push Jefferson over the edge as he continues his downward spiral into darkness so that was a real game changing moment and one of the most shocking moments of season 4 so far and overall I really like this a lot so we now see that the Mona Vista have the weapons which are set to stun but actually it turns out that the stun setting is fatal so it's going to be very interesting how that's going to be used in the line of duty but Aside from all that, this was a very good episode and it's really good to see that Anissa has got her happy ending and is married the love of her life, Grace. So maybe this might see Anissa give up her powers and live a normal life as we continue the final season of season four. But like I said, this was a great episode and I'm really looking forward to seeing how all of this is going to pay off and it's going to be very interesting what's going to happen in the next episode after what Jefferson saw his wife having dinner with his most hated enemy Tobias so there you have it guys I'm going to wrap this up now what did you think of episode 3 of Black Lightning did you enjoy it what do you think Jefferson's reaction is going to be when he sees that Lynn was having dinner with Tobias do you think this is going to cause their marriage to break down even further or do you think this might spur him on to finally become Black Lightning and also what about Gamby learning about the weapons how do you think that's going to play out in the next episode you know what to do guys hit the like button hit the subscribe button leave your thoughts and comments down below and i will be back next time for another edition of the black lightning season 4 review series where i'll be talking about episode 4 so until next time take care everybody and stay safe